Hey guys, it's me, Tiffany, and Mandy. <laughs> and we are back for a long overdue TTC update. I'm sorry that we never finished with our um, peak at our week vlogs. We just, it was a lot to do vlogs every week, and I felt like they were getting boring because we weren't really doing much. And yeah, so we just decided that doing TTC vlogs each week would be better because that's really what our life's about right now. So, um, I plan to record an update on everything that's happened with me and my body and everything that happened with Kaylin, and I'll try to record that video tonight and get it up, edited and uploaded, and then I'll link it below. So, um, I know in one of the peak in our weeks, I think it was week two maybe, um, we talked about how I was starting to try and still am. Um, first two months weren't successful. Uh, the first month, everything looked good. The follicles and levels and everything were good. It just, it didn't work. Um, so we did the second time, only instead of doing at home insemination, we did IUI. Um, same dose of Femera and everything. Um, so we did the IUI, but my progesterone was really low. So we knew that one wasn't going to work. Um, so now we're in try number three and they've upped my Femera, they doubled it. So hopefully that will help. Here's cross. We don't know yet. Um, we don't have a follicle scan until later on, but she'll tell you about this cycle. So this cycle, um, her cycle day one was last Wednesday on November 13th. And my period from my DNC, which I'll explain in my update, was due anywhere between November 8th and 22nd, I believe it was like four to six weeks. And I just happened to start on November 14th. So we are like 12 hours apart in our cycles. So we thought, why not try together at the same time? So we are going to do that this cycle. We're gonna to try to record every step of the way. Um, both of us have our uh, follicle scans scheduled for Monday the 25th, which is this coming, a week from today. So, um, we will update you as to what happens there. And yeah, so it's exciting. We're excited to try together and see how our story unfolds. <laughs> so pretty much the next update will be, like she said, we have our follicle scans. So we'll update that. We'll probably do the update after the inseminations. Um, and we both have lab work that we have to do for progesterone after all that, but we'll probably do the update in between those two things. So, let you know what the follicle scan showed and when we did everything. Um, I'll be doing the IUI again and then we'll be doing hers at home. So, cross your fingers for us. Hopefully, uh, we'll have two success stories. Yeah. So, is that it? I think so. So, we'll hopefully talk to you again next week and update you on what happened with all of that stuff. And we so. promise with this process, we'll be better about updating. Yeah. So. Until then, bye.